I'm gonna turn that into big one though, so we will. Now today I have a very interesting snake here. I have a foot I have a, a an adult full squirrel snake. And this one is currently in shed so the colours are it here used to be like completely black, but now it's grey because it's going to shed. You can kind of see the red bands. The bands on them fade with uh, fade as you get older. As you get older, the red disappears. And some specimens even turn completely black when they get full size. Okay, so these guys is um they eat lizards. Um, frogs, um, small rodents, and even birds, and yeah, oh, and also other snakes they eat. Right? So, and the scientific name for these snakes are uh, 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 Oxyrophus petola or Oxyrophus petolarius. Yeah, different, two scientific yeah. names. Um, yeah, there's just. You can see how the, how the eyes are turned blue, a kind of bluish gray. And that's because they it's it's going to shed. And when snakes are going to shed, the eyes turn a kind of bluish gray like this. Okay, now so for what I have observed with the snake, it it's um. It's very curious and very calm uh, around humans. It didn't really, really try to get away when I found it. And he just like literally let me pick him up. And they're very, very curious, small and fearful of humans. Squirrels, you unfortunately can't do that by the surface because they are around humans and a lot of humans like to kill snakes. I say that this is a full squirrel snake, people might watch it and think, see the red, and think it's a coral snake and kill it. Or they might just kill it because people don't like snakes. Okay, and these are very good species also to have around your house because they do eat mice it's, and they will eat baby rats, maybe even big rats. And, and goodbye and I'll see you next week and I am off to release a book.